Hey guys, Jeff here. Welcome back to Dark Souls 3. Now, I have got... I'm going to go back to the old um, profane capital now. Um, <clears throat> this is going to be actually... Now, if you remember correctly, I did actually save um, good our onion bro friend from a grisly fate. Now, here all we have to do is literally run. Slide down here and we get and get ready to run because I'm gonna need to take this off and throw in a silver cat ring because basically yeah oh that missed. Oh my god! That's bullshit. That is actual bullshit. It l uh, Fuck off, game. Fuck right off. Ugh. Oh my god. Yeah, this time, luckily, these guys don't actually drain your soul, well, they don't drain um, your health. These are handmaidens, but they don't drain your they, They're actually much weaker than the, the regular jailers. Uh, the jailer handmaidens, they actually don't have the whole drain capability. But they do have fire. I can't see. I um game. Oh, and another one. Now, this time, just go this way. Don't bother about the next areas because this this is boss fog. So, let me just get healed full. To a full health here. Just use the Nasties. Now, for this fight, I don't actually need that, okay? The reason for that is because I'll show you. You you see. So I'm gonna enter here now. Let's see. <laughs> I'm fighting with the un with my friend, the Onion Bro. Oh my old. This is it. They're coming for me. 
I need to hit. Oh yeah, so you can see he now he won't do any da you won't do any damage unless you use this item here. The storm wall. Where is it? I need to do it. Oh. Now all you gotta do is you you, you have to do do this. Hold on. Do <coughs> He's embered. He's embered. Oh god, he's... <coughs> yep. What? Oh god. Onion... My onion bro, help me. <coughs> Sit down, you old me! <laughs> Come on! Love, I love this. I love that fight so much. <clears throat> but now, oh, I should have put on the shit. I forgot to put the shield of one time. Seems my fact now. To your valor. Long may the sun shine. <laughs> this is unfortunately the end of his quest line as well. So this is that uh, shame. Well, the only thing to do. You are a true friend. Well, the only you are Well, the only But now we have the Storm Ruler. Now this is actually not a good weapon, if I'm being honest. It's only good in the Yorm fight. But man, if you... Yeah, so, <clears throat> I'm just going to show this, right? So I had something called Storm King. Now, basically, what you do is you have to hold down your... You have to hold down L1, left trigger, until this shows up, lagging. And then you just do that, and it does a light, it does an amazing, like it smashes a storm at the enemy. It's honestly just an iconic weapon from, now if you never played Demon's Souls, you won't understand why it's so good. But in Demon's Souls, <clears throat> the, um, <clears throat> there was a boss called, what was the boss? It was the... It was one... It was a boss. There was a boss in the Ubisoft, let's just say that. It was a st Storm King, that's what it was. It was a Storm King. And you had to <clears throat> kill him using this. Using that weapon. Now you have to offer these cinders. <laughs> So we can return Yawn to his throne. That means there's only two left. Aldrich and Lothric. Welcome us. Very well then take But first, let me level up. Quick. Oh yeah, luck now increases weapon damage. I forgot to mention this when I started hollowing, using the hollowing chant, but luck increases your uh, weapon damage now. So it's pretty much, luck is probably one of the more, more essential. Hey guys, you're here now. I'm sorry this video is a little bit short, but the problem is my recording fucked up. And basically, I lost the recording, which was a good part of 30 minutes. It's actually kind of frustrating. So... I'm gonna make this blacked out in this blacked out outro to basically explain what happened, what I did on the outside, and what you're gonna expect in the next episode. Now, 
first off, I did actually do a couple soul farming routes. I didn't actually die at all, so that was fun. But then I ended up going through um, the sewers again and going straight back to open the shortcut to Pontiff. I didn't fight Pontiff, thank God. If I'd have actually fought Pontiff and the recording fights up, I would have actually been screaming because that is such a great fight. But yeah, that was about it. Um, I also got some items from Sigwald because he, um, if he finished his quest line, I don't know if it's in the recording, but... If you finish the quest line from Sigvold, he will actually give you his items back. So you get the Storm Ruler, you get another Pierce Shield, you get his entire set, basically. Set for free, if you follow his quest line, and you, of course, do that. Other than that, I'm kind of sorry that I've had to do, you know, make this small outro, but the recording's fucked up, and I can't actually go back because Dark Souls doesn't have any saving, which is... I guess fine. Anyways, I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Sorry about the impromptu outro, and I'll see you guys in the next one.